the story begins in the 19, early 1960s with uh, Harper Clements who comes to work at the White House and goes through for a period of several decades. And so essentially the singers were chosen who fit in with that chronology and actually did sing for the presidents during that period. Not only do you get this fantastic kind of entertainment of the songs and you get this intriguing personal story of a woman with a terrible secret lurking in her past, but also you get a kind of a fast track through, you know, five decades of presidential um, tenures in the United States, which is really quite fun. They'll probably have different singers that they prefer or little gossipy bits about the presidents that they didn't know about. There's an awful lot of rich story.